What's up guys and welcome to Natero. I'm the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do a general message for somebody. So let's see who's going to get this reading. <laughs> Libra. What's up Libs? Thank you so much for being here. This message can resonate with you if you have Libra as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. All right, my beautiful Libras. Thank you so much for being here. Again, thank you. Thank you very much. I hope you guys are doing well today. I'm pulling two oracles and then, you know, clarify. Your confidence might be boosting. I like that. I like that. Bottom of the deck is rest and rejuvenate. You could have Scorpio in your chart will be dealing with one because they also had that. So you're definitely being guided, Libra, right now to kind of sit your ass down. <laughs> All right, um, with this card, some of you guys might be getting like mildly sick, okay? It's nothing crazy, but you definitely might be led to like sit down with yourself, like listen to your body, heal your body right now. Um, just be with yourself. Like you need a rest, plain and simple, because you're overdoing it. Okay, let's see. First card you have is anxiety. So something is stressing you the F out. I feel like you don't even want to look at it. Like, that's how stressful it is. Change in reverse. Pero Libra. Some of y'all not going to like this reading. <laughs> Just because I feel like this is going to be a reading about what you are doing versus what you should be doing. Um, you are stressing out about something, but with the change in reverse, you're not allowing change here. Um, that's why there's anxiety. The answer to this anxiety is to allow this change to happen. Point period blank. Like some of you guys could be forced to move or something with a car or something, but it's like, what is this anxiety and change in reverse? Six of Pentacles, the Wheel of Fortune, the Sun, and the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Could be a work thing. Um, yeah, something is faded here to, ooh, dang, to not make you happy anymore. Because it's like the universe wants you to... This is this is a classic lesson in self-love. A classic lesson. Um, you, this place that you're at and this work situation is going to keep giving you anxiety. That's not going to change. The stress level that you're going through, that's not going to change. Because you're the one that has to change. Meaning you're the one that has to get up and leave. The situation is not going to get better, Libra. I'm straight up saying it because I love you and I care about you and I want the best for ya. And I'm not going to be here sugarcoating anything. Um, it was, This was fated to happen. And I know that sounds crazy, but this is a lesson in self-love. Okay? I feel like you depend too much on this, on what this energy gives to you. Okay? Um... To the point where you're not even thinking about removing the energy. This is like, okay, hang with me. This is about to be some like out random situation that I'm about to say. But this is like, this is like, um, you know, you having a trash bag, right? Full of trash in there. And you don't want to, you don't want to get up and throw out the trash because there could be some ants non-lethal baby ants around the trash bag and you want the ants to leave so you're just like no i'm just gonna sit here and wait until the ant leave they're baby ants okay you're not as you're not as scared of ants you're not okay you're an insect lover 
But because there's ants there, you're just like, no, like I can't. There's ants all around there. Like I'm going to just sit here and I'm going to just wait until the ants leave. And then I'll go and take out the trash. The ants aren't going anywhere. The ants are there because of the trash. It's like you have to take the trash out. Libra. Like the, nothing is going to change unless you get up. And then you're, oh, okay, so yeah, so then you're also complaining that the house now smells like garbage. But it's like, it smells like garbage because you won't take out the trash because you're waiting for the ants to leave. So it's kind of like the same situation, like you're having a whole bunch of anxiety in a certain situation, but you, you're, it's like, what are you doing about this anxiety? It's like, you're expecting the thing to change in some way. And it's not the thing that has to change. It's you. And I also want to say this too. The thing won't change, but you have changed because now you're now now your mind and your soul are not on the same frequency. Your mind and your soul are not, you know, at first your mind was like, yeah, this is what this is what this is what's going to happen. Boop, 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 boop. And your intuition, I'm pretty sure was like, no, Libra, let's let's calm it down. Let's do another thing. You wanted to go this route. Great. This is a great lesson for you, right? We, I've been through this. Everyone has been through this. So don't feel like it's only you. I do feel like it is hard for you right now because of the planets and everything going on. It's not easy energy for you. Yeah. These people don't give a freak about you, bro. King of Cups in reverse. They don't care. Page of Wands in reverse. And it's like every time you try to like put yourself out there, you get rejected. You get denied. Like sit down or you know you get shushed i don't know you're not going crazy like this is really happening i feel like some of you guys are like oh my gosh this is like it's like you it's like you could be in denial in a little bit you don't want to believe that this is not going to get better but it's not going to get better you have to leave you have to make the change with this wheel of fortune, this was fated to happen. So it's like everything is happening in, in the way that it's supposed to, which means that if you decide to leave, you decide to do what you got to do, that's also going to happen the way it's supposed to. You, The universe will bring you something good, but you have to let them know, okay, listen, I'm ready for something else. Like, I don't even want to deal with this anxiety anymore. I don't want to deal with any, any stress. I'm not telling you to quit your job or to leave this person. Or I'm getting more, it's like a financial situation. It's like start making plans. Show the universe which way you're trying to go and they will open the door for you. Bring you people, bring you resources that you need to help you along the way. Next card you have is adjacent possibilities. So you have a million and seven thousand ways to do something. Like you, you do. You're being picky. You're being picky. You're like, no, this door is closed. No, this one is tan. No, this one is purple. No, it's like you're giving yourself excuses, Libra. Coffin in reverse. Like something got to end, bruh. Something got to go. Like, bye, Felicia. This could be a Scorpio. Like something has to freaking go. Could be a Leo as well. What is this? Oh, I don't like this energy, Libra, for you. Could be a Gemini or Pisces. Queen of Pentacles in reverse, the Knight of Pentacles in reverse, the Lovers in reverse, and the High Priestess in reverse, bruh. You're not listening to your intuition here. They, they want you to remove yourself from this. I do feel like it, it does feel very passionate, very like you're connected to this person, but that's not what it is anymore. That's what it was, because I feel like this card was upright at one point, but it's in reverse. It don't feel like that no more. It don't. Knight of Pentacles in reverse and the Queen of Pentacles. You're being guided to stop nurturing this. It's not reliable. It's not committed. Like, none of that. Could be a job or an earth sign. Um, and I feel like you're giving yourself a million, a million reasons to not end something. You're like, no, but this. No, but this. No, but this. No, Libra. Look at, look at something exactly for what it is. Just, just don't try to make it you guys don't have Pisces in your chart. Don't try to make something be what it's not. Look at it for for what it is. Don't try to don't take off the rose colored glasses. I'm sorry. I'm gonna be that one today. 
I'm going to be that one today because the universe is really pushing this energy out. And um, you, it's not good for you. Like, that's the that's my main concern is that you are not good, bro. You're not good. You are you could be all over the place with anxiety, stress. You could be unhappy. You could be really sad. Like, you could just want to freaking cry and just say F everything. But we get like that, Libra, when we want others to come and save us. Or when we want, trust me, I've been there years ago. Years ago, I was, I felt the way you do right now. And I literally had to tell myself, ain't nobody going to come and freaking save me. Ain't nobody going to come and make this better for me, for me than me. And I had to put on my big girl pants and do what I had to do. And yeah, it sucks because you have all these people around you and you would think that you would get some help, right? But guess what? Guess what? There's nothing that you can't do. We come here alone. We leave alone. Everybody around us is, is here to guide us and show us and teach us things. But it's not a, it's not a, I need them or I can't do this without them. Yes, you can. You can do anything you want to with anyone you want to or alone or whatever. I feel like I need a pep talk right now. Like, I feel like I need to know that you're the mother effing shit. You know what I'm saying? And that you need to believe in your, in your good luck. And if you go, if you go into the energy leave with saying, this is going to happen for me and I believe it and I'm going to get it and it's going to happen. And it's just, yeah, it's going to, you're going to do it, but you cannot allow fear to stop you. Fear ain't going nowhere. Fear is, a, is an essential emotion that we need. It's always going to happen. You need to learn how to deal with it. You need to learn how to thrive in that fear. Okay. And instead of what I tell everybody on my Instagram is instead of using fear to repel, use fear to propel, like go forward, use fear as an indication that that's the right way to go. Whenever <clears throat> there has not been one thing that I have done out of fear that I regret or that did not work out for me better than I thought. Listen to that better. Not only didn't, not only didn't it work out, but it worked out better. Like I almost want to cry for y'all right now, bro. Oh, Libra. Libra, there's people uh, around you that you know are genuine. A lot of you guys are really sad right now. What the freak? And it's okay. It's okay. Um, it's okay if you're upset. It's okay. Cry. Let all those emotions out. I don't have a spick of Libra in my chart, but I'm feeling this like I feel this energy really heavy. And I know it's hard, Libra. Trust me. I know it is. But you have you have the strength and the courage within you to do this. You absolutely do. You need to just do it and not think about it. Like, don't second guess yourself. Just take the leap and do it. Okay? Whatever you have to do, do it and just like close the computer, turn off the phone, you know, close the laptop. Like, whatever it is that you have that you're being guided to end that... You don't want to just do it and then just like leave the situation, leave the energy so that you're not sitting there festering and overthinking about it. Leave the space where you did it at. If it's over the phone, leave the phone at your house and go for a ride. OK, or turn off your phone. Speaking of that, my alarm is all going on. Yeah, I'm going to have to give me a second because I have to go all the way over there and over there and then over there to go get it. If not, it's going to keep ringing. So give me a second.
One second, leaves. I'm back. It's gonna rain again in five minutes. So I have to hurry up. That's my that's my <laughs> hurry up. But anyway. Damn, but this is this is this is a tough reading. This is a tough reading. I will say that. Um, you have the courage within yourself, Libra. You absolutely do. You just have to find it, bro. I'm telling you. It's in there. It's in all of us. And it's just and the only thing that's stopping us from it is fear. That's it. Stop giving yourself excuses and just rip off the band-aid. Get out of your head. Okay. The next card you have is financial constraints. So Money's tight, okay? Unexpected income in reverse. You're going to have to spend some unexpected money here, Libra. And I feel like it's not a good time because you're already kind of not doing so good when it comes to your finances. Or this might make you um, not, you know, too fancy. What is this? Queen of Wands, King of Swords in reverse, Page of Pentacles in reverse, Ten of Wands, and the Six of Wands in reverse, with the Five of Pentacles, Five of Swords in reverse. Okay, so this is because someone lied about something. Someone wasn't being honest about something. Um, could be you, but take it how it resonates. Somebody here wasn't being honest about something, and it made something a lot harder. Um, and something didn't work out here, and because of that, now. Now you have to spend some money here. Yeah. But this this is ending something. It's like you have to spend this in order for you to end this. Yeah. That was I I also feel like um whatever this is it's like you just in order in order for this to go away, you just got to come out of your pocket. You know what I'm saying? I don't think you're going to be down too bad with the Queen of Wands. I feel like you're still going to be able to, you know, have fun. Um, but I do feel like it's going to be annoying to deal with and to, you know, have to go through. What is this change in reverse and anxiety? You have decisions in reverse with ask for help. So you should definitely um, ask people around you for help here for some advice. When it comes to this anxiety here, decisions in reverse, right? You need to make this decision, period. Dreaming and stop um, like dreaming about it and put it into fruition because this anxiety is causing you a lot more stress than you need to. Like you guys could be really going through it right now. It's okay. Everything's going to work out for its highest good, okay? What is this coffin and adjacent possibilities? You have re-energized in reverse. It's taking so much stress out of you making excuses for this instead of you just making the decision to end this. Waiting in reverse. Yeah, stop waiting. Stop waiting. What is income, unexpected income in reverse and financial constraints? Mystery. I, I don't feel like some of you guys are like, why does this have to happen? Like, why did I have to, this have to happen? Like, some of you guys, like, whatever this is, could be random. Um, I feel like you're not supposed to know why here, but they don't want you to lose hope that things will get better. You have healing. This could be leading you or someone around you to heal this happening. So it's like there could be a bigger reason behind this that it's not in front of your face. It's like a domino effect or a ripple effect that this is going to have this financial situation. Okay. All right, Libra, that's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.